Hi, I'm Pastor Jim McInnes in Venice, Florida. Just wanted to share with you the love of Christ. You know, the beginning of the Bible, there is a, a fantastic uh, story where God reveals the beginnings of man. And one of the most exciting things is one of the saddest things, known as one of the saddest verses in the Bible. That's when man had sinned. And the Bible says, and God came, Adam heard God come walking in the morning, you know, God comes walking, and he says, Adam, where are you? You know, we would think that God's saying, Adam, where are you? Because he had made mistakes, he had fallen. But that's not the tone. He comes and says, Adam, where are you? You see, God, if God didn't care about Adam, which is you, Adam represents all mankind. He could have just left them alone. He could have just said, you know, let them go do their own thing. They don't like me, I don't like them. Instead, he came looking for them. And he says, Adam, where are you? I don't know what your name is. Maybe your name is Mary, Jim, John, Hans. But God says, Hans, I'm looking for you. Mary, I'm looking for you. Where are you? Where are you emotionally? Where are you spiritually? From that very beginning, God reached out to man. And he's still doing it today. He's reaching out to you. And he says with our heart of love, where are you? And if you don't know him, all you need to do is reach out and say, Jesus, here am I. And he'll say, come unto me. Because that's what he says. All, all who are weary. If you feel weary, you feel discouraged, you feel like your life is without purpose, God says, I'm here for you. Well, thank you for today. God bless you. Remember, God is still saying, Adam, where are you? Why? Because he cares where you are, and he wants to lift you out of that place to somewhere higher. God bless you in Jesus' name.